Hello students, welcome back to Rosie Maths class. In this video, we are going to do question number 1 and question number 2 of figure it out given on page number 265 and this is from chapter number 10, the other side of 0. The first question is, write all the integers between the given pairs in increasing order. We need to write in increasing order, that means small to big. The first one is 0 and minus 7. So first I will draw a number line. This is an unmarked number line. And I will put a 0 here. 0 minus 7. Now negative numbers are always to the left of the 0. Okay. What are the numbers between these two? We will have minus 6, minus 5, minus 4, minus 3, minus 2 and minus 1. Now we need to write it in increasing order small to big so smallest is minus 6 then minus 5 minus 4 minus 3 minus 2 minus 1 so these are the integers between 0 and negative 7 and they are in increasing order this is the smallest and this is the biggest next one minus 4 and 4 0 Minus 4 is this side, 4 is this side. That means the smallest number will start from this side. So the numbers are minus 3, minus 2, minus 1. Then we will have a 0, 1, 2, 3. Minus 3, minus 2, minus 1, 0, 1, 2, 3. See, minus 8 and minus 15. I am drawing a number line so that you understand which is the smallest number and which is the biggest number. Now I will put a 0 here, minus 8 is suppose here, then minus 15 would be somewhere this side, right? And we need to find out the integers between these two. So we will have minus 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So we will start from minus 14, minus 13, minus 12, minus 11, minus 10, minus 9. This is an increasing order. Minus 14 is the smallest integer and minus 9 is the biggest integer. Next one, minus 30 and minus 23. Same way, I will draw the number line. Put a 0. Minus 30 is here. So, minus 23 will be here. Now, we will just find out what are the numbers in between these two. Okay. So, minus 30, here we will have minus 29 minus 28, minus 27, minus 26, minus 25, minus 24. Question number 2. Give 3 numbers such that their sum is minus 8. So we need 3 numbers and when we add these 3 numbers, the answer must be minus 8. So first let's see how I can find out 8. I can find out 8 as 4 plus 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 plus 1, 8, right? But then I need minus 8. So what I will do, I will put a minus here. Minus 4, minus 3, minus 1. So all minus now. So we add this, 4 plus 3 plus 1 is 8 and then you just have to put the minus sign. For this question, there is no fixed answer. There are many different ways you can get minus 8. So, I have just taken these three numbers, minus 4, minus 3 and minus 1 when added gives minus 8. Hope this is helpful to you. Thank you.